Right. Uh, you know, we have um, 70 people registered and 100 packets, and I know that this is one of multiple instances when this organization has been distributing diapers and formula and also activity kits. Uh, you can just imagine how much help this is for families. Um, as families are having difficulties getting yeah. toilet paper and paper towels, I know for a fact that they're also having difficulties getting diapers, um, especially diapers for infants and newborns. Those just seem to be even more difficult to obtain. And while parents are concerned and their children are home more, um, there's just so many stresses on people. Having to worry about putting diapers on your baby should not be something that people have to worry about. So this distribution today is really helping people because not only is it providing diapers, it's also providing formula. I also understand from First Five that there are families that have WIC, women, infant, and children, which gives people the opportunity to have government assistance to access diapers and formula. However, the distribution sites that take WIC also are having different obtaining diapers and formula. So even if you have a WIC um, certificate, you can't access those items. So the fact that it's right here at a site that people are used to coming to because they often come to court for reviews is amazing. And the fact that First Five has been able to use its network, sort of uplifting everyone by using its network to access those diapers is extraordinary. And it's only because First Five's been in the community for as long as it has that it's been able to have those um, distribution partners and access the items that even with partners can't get. So this has been really a very useful thing for people. It's been great because I've got to see the people I recognize in court driving through the court parking lot in a different way. Um, one lady just drove by with her five month old in the back and I got to take a look at the baby who's very big for five month old and growing well. So this has just been a really nice event. And for so many of us who are sheltering in place and working remotely, we don't have the opportunity to connect with people in the community. And um, I know for myself, I feel really worthless and helpless because I'm not doing what I normally do. So this has just been great too for the people helping to be able to come and connect and feel a sense of purpose. So thank you so much for doing this today.